This is the Clipfolio sales team leaderboard. So what I love about this dashboard is that it really allows the rep to um, compare themselves not only to other team members and see how they're doing relative uh, their performance relative to everybody else, but it also shows them how they're doing relative to the expected results for the period. Um, these aren't our sales reps, obviously, but if you look at Matt, for instance, and you drill in on his specific view, he can see how his key measures are for the month. You know, we, we compensate Matt on, on uh, new monthly recurring revenue, uh, new logos or new customers, and then how many demo calls do they do? And across all three of those key measures, he, Matt can see exactly how he's doing um, at any point during the month. So the moving target, in this case, shows that you know, he's behind target in terms of uh, his MRR target, where he should be on a, a linear target. And in terms of new logos, he's pretty close. So in this case, it's Amber because he's within a striking distance. If he was at or above his, um, his moving target, that line would be green. So uh, Matt can not only you know, come to this dashboard on a regular basis to see how he's doing, but he can also then, with a quick look, he can see how he and his territories are doing against the other guys. So in this case, we have a frontline team and we have a backline team. The frontline team is very focused on closing new accounts um, and the revenue associated with the, those new accounts. The backline team, which is the lower team, Tina, Tom, and Simon, are the account team. Those people are responsible for working with customers that are already customers of Clipfolio. And they're measured on how much expansion um, uh, revenue comes from their account territory. They're also measured on the number of onboarding calls they have. Every new customer gets an onboarding call. And we know statistically also that if we talk to a customer in their first few weeks and we give them their uh, basic onboarding um, session, that their chances of success go way up. And on top of that, they invariably stay longer and they don't cancel or churn. Um, while we do publish this dashboard and people can go to it themselves, um, uh, we put it up on a big wall board. And so not only, um, not only are individuals looking at the dashboard at their desk, which we see a lot of, but it's also up on the wall for everybody to see. Everybody in that, in that um, who comes into the success pod um, sees who the winners are today and uh, who's on fire and, and who's maybe um, needs to sort of step it up a little bit to catch up. And uh, that hel healthy energy and competition is uh, very powerful. And, you know, that's enabled by putting um, great information in front of you know, already motivated people um, and just giving them that little extra um, um, performance injection.